Uh, the national debt is now over $29 trillion. That's more than double a decade ago when then Vice President Biden went across the street and led discussions with lawmakers at the Blair House. Uh, you said that he's encouraged that uh, Leader Schumer and Leader McConnell are discussing this issue, um, but does he want any direct engagement himself? Do you see any sort of scenario where uh, the president tries to strike some sort of grand bargain like President Obama and John Boehner tried to attempt a decade ago? I think you're combining a few things there, so let me do my best here. Um, one, the debt limit is about paying the bills that are already due, right? And so our, pro our proposal, our preference, is always to do that through regular order uh, and just raise the debt limit uh, to ensure that we are uh, protecting the full faith and credit of the United States uh, government. As it relates to what the debt looks like, we agree. That's why the president was opposed to the $2 trillion in uh, tax cuts for the highest income that contributed to a portion of that. That's why Build Back Better is entirely paid for uh, by uh, asking corporations and highest income Americans to pay more. So uh, the debt limit, I would say, is, uh, you know, the president is encouraged by the conversations uh, between uh, Leader Schumer and, and Senator McConnell. Uh, and what his hope is, is that we can through regular order, raise the debt limit, as has been done 81 times in the past, so we don't play around with the full faith and credit of the United States. Go ahead. Uh, thanks, Jen. Uh, there's